My God, sir. <laughs> I know Sharon's Karen, bro, but I don't like Sharon. Wow, that's that's just me, man. Shit. <laughs> no Eskimo brother here, sir. But uh, my shout out to you, bro. Beautiful man. <laughs> Man, that was like, there's a picture I post sometimes where it's like, here's the pocket, here's the out of pocket, and then wilding. <laughs> that one was wilding, bro. Man, pro fighter, man. Best thing about the crypto slash red pill community is that you guys support each other and want the best for everyone. Y'all have my respect for that, of course, man. We're here to improve men's lives and uh, get out of this fucking bullshit sort of oppression that we're in right now. <laughs> so shout out to you man hit the like button subscribe and then uh yeah please man um follow me follow me on um uh, follow me on instagram you guys this is the real instagram i'm putting it on the chat right now go follow me on instagram you guys um don't fall for the fake ones i mean i don't want to hear i don't really want to hear about another person getting scammed again for for uh, falling for a, a fake dcc dming you asking you for money or your private keys so just go follow and stuff like that i, I post cool shit and stuff and i just don't want it that's the real one right here okay that's my real Instagram right there. I think I'm following like 94 people. Go follow me on Instagram. Don't, don't get, don't get fucking rugged and shit. I'm not gonna DM you unless we meet in person. And I'm like, yo, bro, I'm gonna DM you tomorrow at two o'clock. Well, then that makes sense, right? But if you know, I'm not just gonna randomly DM you. You know, so there you go. Beautiful. So you mean if I send you one Bitcoin, you're not gonna send me two back? I'm just saying. <laughs> Oh, that's hilarious, you guys. That is freaking funny. That's so sad, but inevitable. Yeah, it's just, this is why we do the crypto mindset courses because like people who've taken the course aren't falling for this. But there's new fans that we're that we're getting from from Instagram and just just from just from YouTube and stuff. We have brand new people we're getting into the channel and stuff. We're growing at a really good pace right now. That that haven't taken the crypto mindset course and that are falling for for like these very simple sort of like hacks, basically, or like. Or rugs, basically. And, you know, this is some of the stuff we teach you to defend yourself against. That tons to go. That, that South Korean karate and shit. We, we show you how to block all that stuff. And spinning back this kick. Someone in the face from that stuff. So there you go, man. No Illuminati. DC looking so handsome and rich. Thank you, sir. I'm trying. <laughs> Let's see. Tap two. My December flight has a 24-hour layover in LA. I'll buy you a beer if I can. Let me know what you're when you, just DM me tap two, bro. We'll we'll meet up, bro. We're not that far away. <laughs> we'll go get a we'll get a steak or something, man. Yeah, if you guys are if you guys are if you guys are in uh Vegas and stuff like that, then you know we'll try to link up and stuff and I'll try to have some I'll end up having some location thing where you can like we do a meet and greet and stuff where all can hang out. Obviously anyone who's in the Citadel will find out about it first with the crypto mindset quarter three. Afterwards I'll tell everybody else um, where to meet up and stuff. And so I might have a private event, uh, just like a little meet and greet for everybody else and we can hang out and stuff. And then we'll have more of a private uh, meet and greet here in Vegas. So we're definitely gonna do some cool stuff here in, in Vegas in the next week or so. <laughs> yeah. Makes me understand why people are intimidated and scared of crypto. Yeah, it's not the easiest thing in the world, but that's actually the biggest bonus in the world is because it's not easy. There's tons of money to be made. Not everyone's onboarded. The prices are down. You can learn it now while it's hard. And then as more money comes in, you're in this position where you just all this new people's capital comes in and you just float to the top, like Christ-like, you know? But definitely tap two. Hit me up, man. Once you're in town, we'll we'll we'll, we'll try to make we'll try to work something out. Let's see. Hodling Ebby, a fake DCC account. Follow me on on Instagram earlier today. Shortly after I followed you, they messaged me, and I knew right away that was fake. Reported them. Yeah, every every one of these fake ass like accounts report these son of a bitches, man. Like this shit is crazy, dude. Um, today I even posted a video on the Instagram and stuff like on the Instagram. Wow, I'm like a grandpa <laughs> on the Instagrams. On the book faces. Um, but, um, yeah, I posted this fucking video of me, like, driving around and stuff, just playing, like, a bunch of, of like, meme songs and stuff, Pepe songs and stuff. So, uh, for all this quality, quality content, um, follow me on Instagram, you guys. <laughs> Let's see. Um, I tried to onboard a lady at my county office to Hex. She seemed totally interested. I almost felt like DCC when I had the elevator. <laughs> that was too – that was hell. That's cool as hell, man. 
you know, one, one easier way you can just onboard them right away is like, even though it's not the best cost basis wise is, but still like the price is down pretty low is you can have them download a trust wallet and then right through there, they can put a credit card and just buy a and buy like some hex right away. And then from there, the, you know, you're able to help them out over time and stuff and buy it through MetaMask, but that way you're cutting a couple steps open and then they get instantly get, they can get four or 500 bucks into hex or whatever cryptocurrency or Ethereum, and then they're in the game. That's what's so cool about it. Hedron to the moon, bro. Man, I think we hit. We, I, there might be a 2x left in this. Maybe a little bit more before we get a nice uh, sell-off and stuff. But we, 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 got some, we got some numbers left in Hedron. That's for sure. If Okay. Uh, Shiwa? I think that's your pronounce name. If in Vegas, stay hydrated. Don't get stuck outside in the heat wave coming, especially for those of you guys who work hard on the sauce. Yeah, yeah you guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let, let, me, let me give you some let me give you Vegas advice. The least amount of time that you can spend. So you, the strips where all the casinos at, that's where all the hotels at, that's where all the hoes at, all 304s, all the gambling and all the drinks, right? On the clubs and stuff. Try to just as, as beeline as fast as you can from hotel to hotel. Don't just be just walking outside drinking. You are going to get dehydrated and smashed in a bad sort of way, and sunburned. For you guys that are not used to the heat out here, it is normally, like, we're not as hot as we used to be right now because normally, the like, Las Vegas is like 115, 116 degrees about a month or two ago. Right now, we're, we're averaging 105 to 110. It's still extremely, really hot. So if you're not used to that, especially from your other part of the country and stuff, the Midwest or the East Coast and stuff like that, it gets very hot over here in Vegas and stuff. So if you're drinking, you're drinking like a racehorse and stuff like that, you can literally get very, very, very hungover and really sick and stuff, and you can really have a bad time. So please, for the love of God, you know, like try to stay hydrated and just stay inside the casinos where there's at least some AC so you don't get, you don't overheat yourself. Okay. So yeah, man, shout out to you guys. And that's right, man. Send these fake ass shadow accounts to the, to the, to the shadow realm. <laughs> shout out to my Yu-Gi-Oh fanboys, man. I love that. Um,